All right, so I have a lot of stuff to do today. I have to put away all the laundry I did yesterday and I have to, oh, make this video. I'm gonna have to watch My Hero Academia because I'm a little behind and I have to literally catch up because my friend Lewis is telling me about stuff and I have to be caught up. So um, I decided to do this video because I saw it on Instagram. And I was like, oh, this would be a cool idea to make a whole video about. It's got a weird filter, but it'll be great. It's a random questions and uh, you know, it's it's fun. Let's see what they give me. I'm, I'm gonna take this off. Feed you, more like I need you. Anyway, so we're gonna do this video and we're gonna see what happens, what kind of questions they give us for this video and here we go let's go question number one do i have to tap it tap it let's go who inspires you the most who inspires me the most wow that's a good question uh my inspirations come from a lot of places uh weird thing is sometimes i get inspiration from animes like naruto or something like that so like my inspirations for like how i want to be as a person is based on naruto that who that's who inspires me the most and my inspirations come from other places, like randomly, like it could be a YouTuber, like Bro Wattis or somebody like that, or anybody like Brian, Phase Rog, anything. It's just everywhere. My, my inspirations are everywhere. Coffee order. Ooh, I like uh, vanilla bean frappuccino from Starbucks. That's my go-to. Uh, other than that, anything really, I'll throw anything in there. I like, I like coffee, but sometimes I can't make it, a lot of times I can't make it at home because I don't know, I don't know why. It just, it just gross to me. I had to go somewhere to get it. And it's good. Like I used to love the Keurig, but now the Keurig is like nasty. And now if I make it in that little pot oh, back there, it's nasty. I don't know. I'm using the K-Cups. I just cut it open, pour it in there. So maybe that's it. Uh, yeah, but vanilla bean frappuccino from Starbucks. Take it off the ring light so I can hold it like an old person. Can I sing? Ha! No, I cannot sing. Here we go, baby. Ain't no mountain high enough. Ain't no river wide enough. Nope, can't. It's just something I can't do. I wish I had it. But I don't. One hidden talent. Hidden talent? I don't really have any healing talents. Hilla? Healing talents? I don't have any healing talents either. Uh, hitting talent? Tal wow, I can't say that. Hidden talents. Um, I don't really have any. Uh, I guess I can... Nope. I don't have one, really. Not that I know of. Unless somebody knows me and then they're like, yeah, you have this hidden talent. But I don't really have a hidden talent. I'm pretty good at most video games. Like, I'm like moderate. I'm not the best, but I'm not the worst either. I'm like right below somebody who's like pro level like right below that one like right below the pro level pro level one yeah something like that i guess that's a hidden talent maybe no it's not it's not my gaming sucks scariest thing that ever happened to you okay there's a few but the one was the one time i almost got hit by a car okay so it was like high school and we were like mid it was like midterm so we were leaving class early so i was like all right cool we bought the jet and in the cars it was like a four lane road so we crossed the the coming this way so it was down to this way now so we were walking across the street there was a little divider so i was like everybody was cool the cars on this lane decided to stop i was like all right cool i'm about to i'm about to dart across so i start darting the cop cross and then a car whizzes by and it almost hits me it was like this like not kidding it was like almost as close as this phone is to me to hitting me do i have pets i have a rabbit and a dog rabbit's name is jughead it's not really my rabbit, it's Summer's rabbit that I got her, but it's like, it's a pet in the house. Bandit is a dog. He looks like a pit bull mixed with something else. I have no idea what he is, but he's a excitable little puppy. He's like two years old. He's long, he's three, maybe three. He's a little old, but I mean, he's not a little old. He's a little older than I was originally saying. I don't know what I'm saying anymore. My words are hard. Yeah, but that's it. First car, first car was a 2000, 13 Toyota Corolla. It is now my sister's. I gave it to her because I was like, man, I'm about to switch up. I'm about to switch up. Give me a used car. I don't want to be making these high payments anymore. Then I ended up getting another car. Which the payments were less, but like, yeah. Things happen. Unfortunately. I'm just kidding. But yeah. The other car that I got after that broke down, it blew up because I got an oil change at Walmart and then it just decided to blow up on me. So yeah, that's what happens. Anyways, let's see what happens. Favorite designer? Gucci. I don't know. I don't have a favorite designer. I like Nike. <laughs> I like you know what I'm saying? Adidas. No, I don't really have a favorite designer. I haven't really looked into fashion that much. I really like clothes, but I don't have I never have money to actually buy clothes, so I never look into putting things together. So yeah. I don't really have a favorite designer. Worst date. Um I've, I've never really gone on dates, so I don't really have a worst date. 
Um, but if we're talking about worst date in like the sense of like days, uh, we're going to say May 20th, 1994, the day I was born because I was trapped in this world. <sighs> All right, let's see what we got going on here. Where were you born? Orlando, Florida, in a military hospital because my dad was in the Navy. Who's your best friend? I have a few. I have a few, few, few. Uh, Summer and Lewis. Lewis and Summer are my best friends. Uh, Lewis gets my sense of humor. Um, it's just like, we, we can talk about whatever all the time and just somehow it becomes a joke and then we can make the worst jokes known to man. And Summer, we've been through a lot, so that's just, that's just how it goes. Uh, you know, always there for each other. Same with Lewis, so like, anytime he needs me, I'm like, you need me to square up, Doc? Insane for summer, but like, Loki, Lewis is my favorite. Whoop. Uh, last time you cried. Wow, that was like recently, man. I have mental breakdowns like every two weeks, like not even joking. I'd be like crying every two, two days. Every Tuesday, I cry. Like I'd be crying. <laughs> and I'm an ugly crier too. I cry ugly, bro. I cry like, <laughs> You know what I'm saying? I be getting them real tears now. You know what I'm saying? It's crazy. But yeah, I don't know. Probably like two weeks ago, maybe. I cry a lot. What's your zodiac said? I'm a Taurus, baby. I'm actually on the cusp, so I'm a Taurus slash Gemini. So I can come across you both ways, baby. What's up? You want to fight? I don't really fight. I'm not the fighting type. I'm a lover, not a fighter. But I will mess you up, dog. Straight up. Yeah, but yeah. I don't know. I don't know what that means. I don't know what being on the cusp means. I know that it's a thing because I was born May 20th. So it's like right there between the end and the beginning. So it's like, <laughs> I'm crazy. <laughs> Favorite type of food. All right, we're going to go Chinese food. But I love sushi. All kinds of sushi, bro. I'll throw sushi down, bro. Down. Down. Down, boy. Down. I'll throw it down. But yeah, I want to say Chinese food, but I feel like, I don't know. I don't know, bro. Seafood. Oh, seafood. Yeah, that's it. Seafood. Seafood's it. I'm out. Seafood. That's my favorite food. Seafood's my favorite food. Seafood's my favorite food. Seafood's my favorite food. Dream car. All right. I want a Lamborghini Urus. Udis. Urus. Udis. Urus. Udis. Udara. Ooh, Urus. I want a Urus. I want a Toyota. I want a Toyota? A, f a Lamborghini Urus. A Toyota Camry would be nice. No, a Toyota Urus. I mean, f fire truck. A Lamborghini Urus. That's my car. That's the car I want. Yeah. 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 Pet peeve. All right. I have no pet peeves. Actually, I, I don't know. Pet peeves rude people i can't stand rude people bro rude people is the worst they'd be like hey can i have not go calm down all right calm down that's the only thing i can't stand rude people and overly aggressive people like anything else is like cool like i don't really care you do your thing man if you want to sit there and pick your fingernails pick your nose in front of me i don't really care don't spit at me though spitting is another thing don't spit at me unless you know me like that what's up <laughs> i'm just kidding oh my god i wonder why i made that joke so pose pose Pose. Current job? Huh. It's called unemployment. Ever heard of it? God, I wish somebody would hire me. Like, hire me. Like, now. Like, yesterday. Hire me yesterday. Like, I need a job bad. I apply to a lot of things, and no one hires me. Please. I'm really nice. I'm a nice person. I'm real nice, dude. Hire me. Please. Please. Like, now. Yesterday. Who's your celebrity crush? I don't really have one. Paul Rudd. Paul Rudd. I don't have a female one. I don't have a female one. At the current moment. Um, yeah, Paul Rudd. For sure. Let's go, Paul. Me and you. I'll be your wasp. You can be my Ant-Man. What's up, dude? What's up? Favorite hobby? Oh, um, oh, wow. Uh, TikTok. 
Making TikToks are fun. Making videos is fun. Uh, playing guitar is fun. I haven't done that last one in a while. Playing video games, that's that's a great one. Um, Yeah, I like a lot of things. Uh, Yeah, yeah, one of those, one of those. Yeah, one of those. I can't, I can't pick a favorite, they're like my children. I love my children differently. I don't love them differently. I would say making TikToks is the funnest one. Making videos is fun as well. But TikToks take the cake recently because they're really fun to make. Yeah. All right. First kiss. My first kiss went a little like this. I was 13, I believe. And I was a girl that I was with when I was 13. And I don't really remember, like, the first one. Like, how do you remember the first kiss? It's not, like, something that's, like, a fairy tale where you, like, remember it for the rest of your life. It was, like, something that happened. And it was, like, all right, cool. Moving on. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know. I can't, like, I really, I, I remember who, but I don't remember when was the first one. It was one of those times when I was 13 or something like that, maybe. Favorite music genre. My favorite music genre right now is like hip hop, rap, that good stuff. Um, I like a lot of genres though. So like I can go from anywhere between K-pop to J-rock to uh, pff, rock, pop, hip hop, anything, bro. I'm like an all type. I can't really do country that hard. I can get into some country, but I can't do a whole bunch of it. It's just not something I can do. You know what I'm saying? I can't. When I'm a whoa to country and like the fiddle and the guitar and the banjo all go ooh, and you know i can't i can't i can't i can't how many kids do you want um i'm up in the air all right i'm anywhere between zero to four zero to four technically i already have one stepchild so that's that's one so zero is not a po not possible anymore so we're doing one to four i'm good with one though we can stop at one we can stop. We can be done. Like, no more. Ever. <laughs> last time you went to the gym. Alright, last time I went to an actual gym was sometime in March 2017? 2018. 2018. Before I couldn't afford it. Um, I couldn't afford it then either, really. Things got expensive real fast. Uh, I think it was 2018. Yeah, 2018. Yeah, because it's 2020 now. Yeah, March 2020. No, March 2018. Yeah, I was at some gym. I can't remember the name of it. It was a very expensive gym. I mean, I think gyms are very good anyways, but it was very expensive. But you can go at any time. It was 24 hours. So I was like, why not? That's a good time, you know, but whatever. Yeah, that's the last time I went to a gym. I do work out by myself, though. Dream job, YouTube or TikTok or I mean, not TikTok, but like YouTube and then like maybe acting and stuff like that. I kind of want to just build, be an entrepreneur, build myself up and, and have to rely only on myself because having to apply for places and then not know if you're going to actually get the job and then people are rejecting you even though they haven't met you face to face and they haven't seen my face or met my personality because I am a ray of God darn sunshine, baby. I'm a God darn sunshine ray. Anyways, but yeah, I kind of want to just, you know, get in the entertainment industry. Uh, definitely want to be my own person and make my own stuff. That's definitely what I've always wanted to do. Make my own production company, help other people who want to be actors and stuff like that. Do, do, you. Uh, do you have any tattoos? I have five. One, two, three, four, five. I have three on my back, two on my arm, and we call that a five tattoo ordeal. I want a lot more, like a lot more. I want to cover this whole arm up. Maybe even this arm. But I do high key love the one sleeve look on people. It looks so dope. Having two sleeves is dope, but having one sleeve looks like you like have some kind of power in this arm and you're like, I will use it, but I'm gonna use my other hand, my 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 less inked hand, because I don't wanna have to kill you, son. I don't have to kill you. I don't know. I just like that aesthetic. It looks cool with just one arm. <laughs> Three things that make you happy. Wow, that's really some of these things can't be said out loud because they're very inappropriate. I'm just kidding. I'm not kidding. You know what I'm talking about. What's up? Anyways, um, no. Um, we're gonna go YouTube, making, creating, all that kind of stuff. TikTok, making, creating, just creating stuff is one. Music is two. Uh, spending time with friends is three. That's that's my ma major thing. You know what I'm saying? Friends can be family and stuff like that. But like 
spending time with people and just hanging hanging out having fun having a good time those three things make me happy i love making jokes because if you ever meet my family we're loud crazy and we just make jokes all the time about each other and everything so it's all good yeah those are the three things three things three things, three things. Babe. i think that's all of them favorite music artist okay my favorite music artist is a very difficult thing for me to conjure up the idea of because i have several artists and bands i am in love with okay you got uberworld which is the best band in my opinion because they're so versatile they do everything you got bts because they're so versatile and they're so extreme and hype um we got like people like uh watsky we got hoodie allen mm, man it's just the list goes on and on it's like a it's a non-stop thing you know it's a constant it's just hard to pick one and i can't pick one so i don't have a favorite music artist my favorite music artist is the world of music if that makes sense as a cop out but you know what i mean well let's see if it gives me something that i haven't got before one of the one thing you're embarrassed to admit mm, well um i don't really get embarrassed so i don't really have an embarrassing thing um one time i was real sick and i poop seed in my pants this was like when I was like 18, 19. No, not even. This was like 22, 23, about that era. It was like two, three years ago, maybe four. I don't know, one of those. I was working at Family Dollar. I was sick, and every time I went to sleep, I pooped teeth my pants. This is a real thing that happened. Every time, every time. I woke up, I had to change pants four or five times at night. I didn't go to work the next day. Of course not. I was scared. I was scared I was gonna have to poop seat my pants again. But here we are. Living life. No poopsie in here now. It's clean. It's clean butt now. Yeah. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, I really had a fun time doing it. If you guys have any more questions you want to ask me, anything, literally can be anything, I have zero shame. You can ask me as many questions as you like. I will answer them all because I like to do this. This is fun. I like to give information about myself because I never really do. I like to really keep it to myself unless you ask. I don't offer information up like that. I'll answer them in the next video or the next video after that, depending on how many I get. Or I may do one question a day. Maybe it might be a good time. Ooh, that'd be fun. Yeah, give me one question in the comments and I will answer them each video. Duh, let's do it. Boom, boom, boom. Anyways, um, guys, I hope you have a great day. Hope you have a great year. Hope you are enjoying life to the fullest. If not, well, you know, stay positive, bro. It happens. We all be good eventually. Everything is temporary. So you could be in a bad situation right now, but two, three months, three years from now, bro, you rich living in a mansion and out here eating grapes. You could be eating grapes right now, but like you just chose not to because you're making bad health decisions. But you know, you could get to the grapes eventually. Unless you're allergic to grapes, don't eat them. But, but yeah, I'll, I'll see you guys later. Bye.